Hello everyone, welcome to the Easy Accordion Pro plugin video tutorial series. Today I'm going to explain to you another most amazing feature of the plugin which is how to configure fixed content height for accordion. Make sure that Easy Accordion Pro plugin is installed and activated into your site. You can directly click on add new or you can click accordion groups and then click add new to create a new group and give it a title. I have already created a few accordion groups for you. I will explain the rest of the video from the accordion groups I have already created. Go to the groups and select it. You can see I have already given it a title and added a few content. Below that you can see there are three configuration tabs. Initially I am in the accordion settings. Scroll down a bit and you will find the option fixed content height. This feature is set to a certain height for the description field. If a user has different amount of content and he wants to show each of them in a fixed height, he can tick the checkbox and set a height value in the maximum height field. There will be a vertical scroll bar for the larger content. If the feature is unchecked, then the content's height will be as long as the content has on an accordion item. Let's keep it unchecked and click show preview. You can see the content height is different for each accordion item. Now let's check the box and set a maximum height of 200 pixel. Update the preview and you can see the description field is getting a 200 pixel height with a scroll bar like this. So this is how the fixed content height feature works. Now publish the shortcode. Now in my case it is showing update because I have already published it. To skip the changes you need to update it. Let's update it and go to a page where you want to display it. Insert the shortcut using the Easy Accordion Pro Gutenberg block. Select the shortcut and you will get a preview of it. Now publish the page and view it. You can see the accordions are showing with a fixed content height. That's all for today. In the next video, I will come up with another attractive feature of the plugin. Until then, take care.